Hey guys, this is Saurabh Nahal here from All About Technologies and in this video I'll show you how you can make your Android smartphone faster and also you can get some additional storage on your Android smartphone. So here are the 5 tips for your old Android smartphone. So without wasting any further time, let's begin. So starting off with the first tip, you have to go into the settings, under settings, go into about phone where you will see build number. Just tap on the build number for 7 times and then you will be a developer. So once you are done with that, go into the developer options, under that you will see something called the drawing. Under that you will see transition, animation and window animation scale and all these options. So if at all your window animation scale is 5, you will see that how slow this was. So if you make it 0.5 or if you completely turn it off, you'll see that how fast it becomes. So I would suggest you to make it 0.5 or just completely turn it off. And that would make your smartphone very faster. And if at all your transition animation is like 10, so you can see that how it's slow it is. And it is really slow and annoying. So if you want to make it much faster and nicer, all you have to do is just make it 0.5 or just completely turn it off. And even if you turn it off, you won't really feel that it is looking ugly or anything like that. I don't feel so. But if you feel that, just make it 0.5 and you should be good to go. So make all the animations 0.5 or completely turn it off. Now the next tip is that go into the developer options. Under developer options, you have background process limit. Just limit it to 3 or at most 4. And by default, it is at standard limit. So I would recommend you to make it 3 or 4 depending on the smartphone. Now the third tip is that go into the storage where you'll see something called cache data and just clear this cache data and you'll get some additional storage on your smartphone because this cache data is not at all useful and it won't really make any changes to your smartphone. So you can just clear the cache data and it will free up some storage for you. And then you can install applications because on older smartphones, you used to get around 4 GB of storage, internal storage and out of that you used to get around 500 or 600 MB of storage. So out of that, if cache data is taking around 50 or 60 MB, so if you remove the cache data, you will get some additional storage and you can install some applications. Now, as I'm talking about installing application, you can install Google Now Launcher, which is really a nice launcher that you can install on your smartphone because by default, Samsung devices comes with the TouchWiz UI, which is li slightly laggy. And I feel that if you install this Google Now Launcher, which is very close to stock Android, it gives you a very close feel to stock Android. So if you install this Google Now Launcher, it will make your device much smoother and faster. So just install this launcher and if at all you are running on MIUI, even then you can use this Google Now Launcher because it looks really close to stock Android and it feels really good. And those who don't like this Google Now Launcher can also download Nova Launcher. Now my fifth tip is that you should at least reboot your device or switch it off and switch it on again once in a day because that will help your device a lot as this is called as the soft uh, reset and it will fix most of the basic issues on your smartphone. So I would recommend you to at least reboot your device once in a day. And yeah, these were some of the tips for your old smartphone. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please hit that like button down below. That helps us a lot. Also hit that red subscribe button if you want to see more content like this. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Google+, Instagram, Snapchat. All the links will be in the description down below. Also check out my Snapchat tricks video as you can see over here. And this is Saurabh Nahar here from All About Technologies. Thank you guys for watching.